Hello mga katribu! Magandang araw and welcome back to Tribune Extra. I'm Aizel once again at dahil dyan meron na naman akong bagong kwento sa inyo ngayong araw na to. Mga katribu, mukhang hindi pa po yata natatapos ang mga intriga sa recently concluded Miss Universe pageant. Yung uh, recently lang, no? yung 69th Miss Universe. Recently kasi nagkaroon ng sagutan on social media ang team ni Miss Canada, Nova Stevens, at ang world-renowned Dubai-based Filipino designer na si Michael Cinco nang sisihin po ng kampo ni Nova ang designer sa pagkatalo ng kanilang kandidata sa pageant and even accused him of an unprofessional behavior. Bakit? Okay, this is the story. MG Mode Communications, the team behind Miss Canada, uh, allegedly commented on Instagram which appears to be deleted now kasi hindi na siya nakikita na late daw dumating yung mga gowns uh, for Nova that uh, Michael made at karamihan pa daw ay hindi kasha sa kanya. And to quote, uh, we love Michael but this was inexplicable at the same time they had time to custom make a gown for another candidate. Things don't add up. Sadly, end of quote. Kaya naman, in response, nagpost si Michael ng photos ni Nova during the preliminaries wherein she was seen wearing his gowns. Kaya daw, hindi totoong hindi nakarating ang kanyang mga gowns on time. He was even asked to make Nova's 26-inch waistline fit into a 23-inch gown to make Miss Nova look even sexier. Dahil dyan, Michael said, quote, Next time, don't ask me or any Filipino designers to dress up your candidates. Ask your Canadian designers to showcase their works in the world stage. Stop taking advantage of my kindness and stop scamming Filipino designers, end of quote. Samantala, nagpalabas naman po ng kanyang uh, side of the story itong si Ms. Nova through an Instagram video. Sinabi niya na nasasaktan daw siya sa mga pangyayari because she has nothing but love for both parties. She also thanked Michael for creating the most beautiful gowns she ever could have imagined to wear at highlight daw ng kanyang career ang pakikipagtrabaho kay Michael. Pero pinabulaanan niya that she is ungrateful. Dahil she has repeatedly expressed gratitude daw to Michael both privately and publicly. In the end, nakiusap siya na wag na lang bahira ng negativity ang once-in-a-lifetime experience niya ng paglaban sa Miss Universe at kung may kailangan daw pag-usapan, e eh, ayusin na lang daw ito privately. Okay? And that is it for me. Kung meron pong uh, development on story na yan, I will definitely keep you posted. This has been Izel. You have just watched Tribune Extra at mag-ingat po tayong lahat.